who's gonna take that off when we find him? I don't know. Maybe the city. Hello my fellow snippers and newbies. Welcome to my channel. My name is Marlene Cohen. I lost my bird. So those of you who are tuning in right now that are my family initiated snippers, you know that basically we're just giving you updates of everything that I've been doing. It's 11, 16 p.m. We're putting them all along the boulevard. George is putting up the flyers and I'm driving, which is a recipe for disaster, but he's still best at putting up the flyers. You know how it goes when he's like, where is he? Do you guys see him? Oh my god. Anyway. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so... I can literally hear him taping from here. What's up? <laughs> now today something very special happened. Besides for the fact that George has already ran out of three packs of tape, this guy is taping up Los Angeles like tape is, like there's an influx of tape in the world. I have no idea. Anyway, we do this at night because it's so hot during the day. Oh, I know what I was gonna tell you. Something crazy happened. Now, you know that we did this all night last night and then we decided we would finish tonight. And when we got to the car tonight, after I spoke with the intuitive, can you hear him? We came back to the car and there was a feather on the car. George was like, wait, do you see that feather? He starts driving and then he pulls over. There was a feather right in between the windshield and the wiper as if it was placed there but there's evidence that it wasn't placed there like by a human so i don't know i think it's a good sign it's a crow feather oh my gosh where are you facing it what's he doing imagine if this guy walked by and said oh i know where your bird is where are you facing it the people there I'll do another one. <laughs> How do you feel about that? Do you think it's going to stay? Yeah. Why does it say my door is open? That door is open. Does this mean my door is open? Yeah, my door. Open too. You're funny. I opened my door. So that's why you were saying that. No, but it said both doors. No. Here. See, both doors are open again. Oh, see, this car is not that advanced. That was a hard one. Anyone ever told me every single one of them? No. Or are you just making fun of me right now? No. I'm just making sure it doesn't fall. You know, just in case it rains. You've rainproofed it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm taping the top, the bottom, the middle, but then I'm covering the areas that are paper so that way water doesn't, you know. I don't know. <laughs> Good okay. job we don't have a drought in California. Yeah, and I did it so that way Starbucks, all the people that come in and out from Starbucks will see it. Yeah. Starbucks is a good place for posting these kind of things. when we find it. I don't know. Maybe the city? <laughs> Nobody's getting that job. Job, take one. Oops, no I can't. Alright. What? I'm 
kidding. <laughs> she's like, I'm gonna get that bird. She's all one thousand, she's like, one thousand. They let you put one in the restaurant? No. So that's why you taped up all the poles? Yep. <laughs> Guys, watch George tape this up. Why are you facing it that way? Why? Because I'm gonna do one on this side and one on the other side. Okay. Imagine we find Picasso and we still have these up like a year later. You know, the etiquette is to take them down. Yeah. <laughs>